when I started farming Shine Muscat on 1,653 square meters of land, I made over $36,000. Honestly, the price had me. Can I tell you the cost of Kelho grapes when I first came here? Hello, I am Zheng Gunhua, and I am farming Shine Muscat at Gimchian, Yang Sangbukdo. The farm is about 16,529 square meters, and right here is about 1,653 square meters. I did not count the number of trees there. In 1,653 square meters, there are about 130 trees. Depending on whether it's grafting or cutting, some can have less fruit or more weeks old. Some of them are four years old, and some are five years old. Farmers usually say that it's the age when trees are most energetic. I am not sure where Shine Muscat originated from, but I remember that it started booming from Gimchian. Gimchian has been cultivating Kyoho grapes for a long time. When I compared the grapes from Gimchian with the ones from other cities, I realized Gimchian's farm and hang technology is better than other places. I visited Yangdong and Chungbuk and went all over the country to observe other farms like other people. The quality of the soil is essential for farming. However, it is hard to say that Gimchan has the best soil to cultivate grapes. Comparing the quality of the crops and farming methods, I think farmers in Gimchian are doing great based on their long experience in grape farming. Many farms in other areas with better soil cannot cultivate this much grapes. With their technology and skills, farmers in Gimchian cultivate this much. So I concluded that they have to have exceeding skills in farming grapes. Honestly, the price had me. Can I tell you the cost of Kelho grapes when I first came here? When I first moved here, according to our open field standard, not the facility greenhouses, the Kyo grapes were $4.33 per 2 kilograms. During August, Shine Muscat was $25 per 2 kilograms box, and in October, it was $26.7 per box. I could not believe it because I hadn't seen the grapes. How can grapes be $25.26? Have you seen it with your own eyes? They said they had never seen it, and I did not believe them. Next year, I started to look into it because I was curious. There was no data, but I heard the rumor that someone had started farming it. No one had seen it, and the price was ridiculous. We farm the same way. The process of growing shine muscat or grapes is the same. They sprout in the spring. We pick the brows and we tie them. I tasted the shine muscat. As soon as I did, I thought, all the grapes in Korea will shift to shine muscat. The biggest problem is that people in the countryside are very conservative since they have never lived in the city. It is not just their political color. They are very conservative in food too. They prefer things they are familiar with and refuse new food. They tried Shine Muscat and said it tasted a bit like cosmetics. They prefer Kyoho grapes and would continue to grow your grapes. That is when I asked, who cleans up your table after you eat right now? Doesn't your wife clean it? Let me explain this by comparing it to the people in the apartment. After eating the Kyoho grapes, the peel piles up. In less than 30 minutes, fruit flies appear. Then, the wife will urge the husband to bring the food waste down to the 15th floor. Even the food waste bin, because it is in the summer. No matter how clean the bin is, the smell is awful when you open the lid. You eat the peel of these grapes. There is no food waste and it tastes really good. I thought, this is the new grape. Farmers would switch into new grapes and the most concerning factor is time. Once the fruit trees are planted, it can take up to two years to make the harvest. In another words, during those two years, there is no harvest. You work but you can't make sales. Even after the price of the shine muscat has dropped, I am hesitant to switch to other crops. A person who is decisive enough to switch the crop is brave, because he or she will have to wait one to two years and give up on couple thousand sales profit. 
Also, there is no guarantee the price of the crops will stay the same after one or two years. When I started farming Shine Muscat on 1,653 square meters of land, I made over $36,000. When farmers first began cultivating Shine Muscat, the person who made the most profit made about $72,000 from the 1,653 square meters of land. This was a couple of years ago. A couple of years ago, when Shine Muscat was first shipped, the person who made the most profit made about $72,578 in 1653 square meters. But now, if you do well on 1653 square meters, you can make about $363,000. But that is not possible right now. It is impossible to make that much from the open field. From the facility greenhouse, you can make about $36,000 if you ship them fast. Calculating the profit at the farm is difficult because we need to account for things like labor and pesticides. At least for the facility farm, considering the depreciation, we can say 60% of the sales can be our profit. This includes expenses such as labor. The person who shipped the crop in June was in this area. The highest price for Shine Muscat in Gimcheon was $51 per 2 kilograms. The difference in the crop will be about $8 after the Chuseok, which is about October. September is usually the month when Shine Muscat is most expensive, from the end of September to the beginning of October. July and August are not the times when Shiny Muscat is most expensive. It was usually about $21 from July to August last year. This year, it has already decreased to $14, or about $18. Appropriate fruit set and an early fruit set. In other words, since there is a total quantity that each tree can manage, I decrease the amount of fruit per tree and the size of the fruit. My tip was to place grow light. Since it promotes photosynthesis, the side with the plant growth LED produces more giant fruits and speeds up growth. It's moving up the maturation period to 10 to 15 days. At this rate, if the sunlight is better for 15 days and I increase the lighting time, it will speed up the period to 15 days. Farming itself is a challenging task. Shine Muscat has a more extended maturation period than your grapes. With tunnel farming, your grapes are harvested in August, and Shine Muscats are harvested in October. It means I need to work for one or two more months. I need to nip grapes off and apply pesticides for two more months. The farmers are paid after harvesting the grapes, so they are paid later for the Shine Muscat. Profit is made in October instead of August.